There are so many high quality text to speech generators out there. And in this video, we're gonna test them out and we're gonna find the best ones. Let's go. Hey, Matt Wolf here. If I come over here to futuretools.io and I click on text to speech, you can see there's 27 different tools on here and that's a lot. So I thought I'd make this video to compare all of the different tools. So what I wanna do is I'm going to open up a handful of these text-to-speech generator tools and kind of pick some favorites and decide which ones are good and which ones aren't. So to start, I'm gonna sort by most upvoted. I will check out Verbatic, open up Listener, Deep Zen, Speech Easy. We have 11 Labs, Narration Box, Koki, Murph.ai, Lovo AI, Play HT, Uber Duck, Resemble. And if I had to guess, I would bet most of them are using something like Microsoft Azure and their API underneath. But let's play around with some of them here. I'm gonna grab some text from this AI generated blog post that we made in a previous video. Let's just grab the first paragraph here and we'll use this as our text to speech generator. Verbatic is the one that had the most upvotes on future tools. Let's go ahead and give this one a try first. So this one pricing starts at 19 bucks a month for 500,000 characters and then has a few other pricing plans beyond that. But it looks like they do have a free trial where we can try 500 free characters. All right, so we're in here. So we've got various languages that we can generate in. I wanna do an English. Let's see if we can demo the, some of the voices here. So let's demo Matthew. I like the name. Hello, you can use any of our voices to synthesize your text as needed. Add additional build-in voice effects to further enhance your speech. And also you can use neural voices to make your speech sound as if it was pronounced by a live human being. We hope you will enjoy our service. All right, that sounds robotic AF. Let's go ahead and try some other ones. That one's obviously uh, not a very natural sounding voice in my opinion. Let's see what Kindra sounds like. You can use any of our voices. Super robotic. Let me see if I can find one that doesn't sound robotic. You can use any of our voices to synthesize you can use any of our voices to synthesize your text as needed. Let's try Sally. You can use any of our voices to synthesize. So far, I haven't heard one that sounds like it's not robotic to me with this verbatic here. Let's try Cora. You can use any of our voices to synthesize your text as needed. Add additional built-in voice effects to... Okay, let's try Jacob. You can use any of our voices to synthesize your text as needed. You can use any of our voices to synthesize your text as needed. All right, let me just go ahead and paste some text in here. Let's go ahead and use... Matthew, the neural, let's use newscaster effect. Let's listen to it. In today's fast paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and increase their competitiveness. One of the most powerful ways to achieve these goals is through business process automation. Automating repetitive and time-consuming tasks allows entrepreneurs to focus on more important business activities and ultimately grow their businesses. Interesting, because when I play this Matthew voice, that didn't sound like the same voice to me. You can use any of our voices to synthesize your text as needed. Add additional... Their example sounds so much more robotic than when you actually play back the demo that you get. In today's fast-paced business environment. That sounds so much smoother to me. Entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and increase their competitiveness. Let's try a different voice and see if it sounds good with a female voice. Let's try Ashley neural voice. See how this sounds. I ran out of characters on my free trial, so I guess all I got to try was the one voice where if you use their demo, it sounds very robotic to me. So like these demo voices don't actually give you a good feel for what they sound like, but then when you use your own text, it actually sounds much better, but you can only test with one voice because you don't really get enough characters to find out. That's verbatim. Let's try some others. Hopefully some others give us a little bit more leeway to actually experiment and see what things sound like. Really surprised that's the most upvoted one on the site. So this one is Listener here, which you can find at L-I-S-T-N-R dot tech. And this one actually lets you try it out right here on the homepage, but it lets you only have a hundred words. So let's see how long my thing is here. All right, so it's 56 out of a hundred words. This one, it looks like I can try for free and I can try a bunch of different voices here. So we've got premium voices and standard. I think I want to use the premium voices here. It looks like it's using some of the same names, so I wouldn't be surprised if the API underneath is actually the same as that Verbatic. We got $9 a month for 10,000 words, 19 a month and 39 a month, but we can actually test it out for free right here on the homepage and see what some of this stuff sounds like. So let's go ahead and test with Cora and let's listen to the sample. In today's fast paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, 
I mean, you can tell it's not a human voice, but it's not too bad. Let's try another one here. Let's try Jacob. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are... All right, that one's super robotic. Let's try Christopher. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money. That one's not too bad, actually. Christopher sounds pretty good in this one. Let's see if we can get a good sounding female voice. Let's try Amber here. In today's fast-paced business environment, Entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency. Not too bad. I like this site because it actually allows me to demo a lot more voices and get a lot more data on whether or not I like it. I'm surprised this one's got the number one product of the day on Product Hunt because they actually give you the chance to listen to some of these. So far, listener looks pretty good. Let's try Deep Zen here. 35 a month or 169 a month. So this one's definitely on the higher end of the pricing. So for 35 bucks a month, you get one user. You don't get API access, you don't get broadcast rights, and all of these say coming soon. I don't even know if you can demo this one. Let's sample some of the voices here. Let's listen to Alice. The wonder of technology today means we can create human-like voices using artificial intelligence. Pod. The wonder of technology today means we can create human-like voices using artificial not great. The wonder of technology today means we can create human-like voices. All right, so I'm going to move on past Deep Zen. They're definitely on the higher end of the price spectrum, and they sound fairly robotic from the first three samples that I sampled. We've got Speech Easy here, so they don't actually give you a price. They have the starter at free, and then Enterprise, they have contact sale. So let's go ahead and start for free, and let's jump into the app, and I'm going to go ahead and paste my text in here, and then we've got some various voices here that are all kind of interesting names like blue zodiac and palm green and not actual people names all right so let's try downy here and let's listen back in today's fast-paced business environment entrepreneurs are no, let's try blue zodiac this one's gonna have an australian accent it sounds like in today's fast-paced business environment entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways all of these seem to say new. I don't even know which one to select because none of this is super descriptive. Let's try Cherry. Cherry is apparently a male youthful voice. In today's fast-paced business environment, oh entrepreneurs... Gosh. Okay, so far I haven't really found any in here that I like. Let's do Royal Blue Youthful English US. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money. That one's actually not too bad. I don't mind that one there. Royal Blue youthful us i really just don't like how they title their their voices here the thing on my color doesn't really mean much to me so let's try uh, rudy female mature or maybe that's ruddy sorry in today's fast-paced business environment entrepreneurs are constantly yeah, that's kind of robotic too. So far of the ones I've tried, Listener seems to be my favorite. Let's keep on moving on here. We have 11 Labs. This is a new one that I think just launched recently. Let's go ahead and paste in our text here. It lets us actually demo it right here on the homepage. So we have Conversational Atom American Clear. So it's converting. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and increase their competitiveness. That one's pretty good. Okay, so that's that one's that one's pretty solid so far. I like that. Let's see what other voices they have in here. Let's try Dynamic Sam here. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve I mean, it doesn't sound bad. I think that voice is kind of an annoying voice, but it's not bad at all. Let's try Dami. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time. And Honestly, Eleven Labs seems to be the highest quality voices so far. Let me try another one here. We've got Josh American Silvery. I'm not quite sure what Silvery means. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and increase all right, these are good. Eleven Labs, they're they're the most solid quality so far. Damn. So they got a free forever plan here too. So long form speech synthesis. So you can't use it for commercial, but you get ten thousand characters a month, up to five voices, API access, and English language. And then for twenty two bucks a month, you can actually use them for commercial use, and you get up to thirty voices. All right. So. 11 Labs seems to be the most solid of the ones I've come across. All right, so we got Narration Box. All right, so we got some examples. He's the reason I go for long walks and the reason I take Sunday afternoon naps. He's- I feel like I'm watching a weird anime. Welcome back. 
It's 9 p.m. and you are listening to MB News Daily. Wasn't expecting that. That's not great. Audiobook. It was a real bully circus. It was the splendidest sight that ever was when they all come riding in. To a splendid sight. So their USP must be that they are not just voiceover. They do sort of background music and voiceover, I'm guessing. So they have a free plan. Gets you 700 words, which we've already found out is not a lot because we already used 500 on one of our other ones and ran out. You get up to five audio uploads. You do get commercial rights on the free plan, though. That's not bad. And then it has $10 a month, $100 a month, and $10,000 a year. But what I heard, I wasn't super impressed with the audio. I wouldn't put it up in my top tier. And I'm going to go ahead and move on. So we got Koki. Koki gives us a try now for free. They do have a free trial, which gives us 30 minutes of synthesis time. So this one's not based on words. It's based on minutes. 30 minutes seems like quite generous, actually. 30 minutes is a lot of audio. Limited voice cloning. Interesting. So you got voice cloning inside the free plan as well. And then for 20 bucks a month, you can get four hours. Or for 175 a year, you can get 50 hours a year. Clone any voice from three seconds of audio. Interesting. So we're logged in here. Let's go ahead and create a new project. So it's only letting me do 250 characters at a time, it looks like. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways. How do we do this three-second voice clone thing? Let's try add voice. All right, so over here, add new voice, chord audio, record your voice reading this sentence. All right, so let's try this here. Once upon a time, the king's youngest son became filled with the desire to go abroad and see the world. Let's go ahead and review our recording. Once upon a time, the king's youngest son became filled with the desire to go abroad and see the world. Create your clone. Let's see if it actually cloned my voice very well. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money. I don't know about you, but I don't think that sounded like me. <laughs> oh, it's using my cloned voice that I created, right? I did that right, didn't I? New take. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and in- Okie dokie, I don't really feel like that sounds like me at all, but maybe I'm doing something wrong. Now we got Murph, Murph.ai. That's just fun to say, Murph. Let's listen to whatever this play button does for us. Back in 1779, the first model of the human vocal tract was created that could produce the five long vowel sounds. This is the earliest known speech synthesis. That actually already sounds like it's off to a pretty good start here. So they got a free plan here. You can't download whatever you create, but you can try all the voices. You get 10 minutes of voice generation, 10 minutes of transcription. You can share a link to the audio output and you get a single user. Then for 19 bucks a month, you can download. Looks like you got some additional languages. You get the commercial usage rights. And then the $26 a month plan, you got some AI voice changer, more hours, more languages, more stuff. Let's go ahead and try the free one. Okay, I'll paste my text in here. This is the voice of Nate. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are cut. No, that's too robotic. Where was that voice that uh, we heard earlier? I think that was Clint. At least it was a picture of Clint. Go fast. Yeah. Go far. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and increase their competitiveness. Yeah, Clint's got a good voice on here. Wait, let's mess with his pitch a little bit. Let's even pitch him down a little bit. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency. All right, Murph's not too bad. I can't download any of these. Clint sounded really good. Let's try Alicia. So let's get a, a female voice in here. I'm gonna bring the pitch back up to zero and let's see what she sounds like. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking- A little robotic, but not too bad. So Murph seems like a pretty good option. You can't really use it for much unless you're gonna pay for it. Let's check out Lovo. It says it's free, but it has, I always love it when it says it's free and then it has a pricing tab. All right, so free $0, 20 minutes of free voice generation credits, no credit card required, fully experience the product before deciding to commit. So you can do pretty much everything with it, but it has a watermark export and you can't use it for commercial. So let's go ahead and get started for free. I think a lot of these are using the same underlying API. That's why we get a lot of the similar voice sounds out of each of them. In today's fast paced business environment, on Victoria. It's all right, let's try Austin Hopkins. This one even has a last name. In today's fast paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money. Sounds like a 
like an actor, an actor. Sounds like an actor. Let's try. So these are the premium voices here. Let's listen to Sally Coleman. What you got for us, Sally? In today's fast paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money. She seems like she talks really fast. Try one more. Try Cody Stewart. He looks young and spry. In today's fast paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency, save time and money and increase their competitiveness. The voice coming out of Cody does not look like the face of Cody. I'm sorry. Not too bad, though. You can definitely tell some roboticness. You can tell we've heard this same sort of voice generation that's going on behind the scenes and some of the other tools already. But you can use it for free. And let's see, I believe you can even download it. You just can't use it commercially. Lobo's not too bad either. All right, so let's check out play.ht. 15 bucks, 30 bucks, or 50 bucks, 240,000 words per year. So let me switch to monthly here because that's easier to grasp. 20,000 words a month, standard voices, audio previews, audio downloads. The 20 bucks a month only gets you standard voices. So you got to get up to 40 bucks to get realistic voices or 100 bucks gets you uh, white labeled audio players and some other goodies. But if you want to use it for commercial license, need it for 40. So I mean, this $20 a month plan is pretty useful in my opinion because you only get their standard voices and you don't even get commercial license so this one's at 40 bucks a month just to have anything sort of meaningful to use and what do you bet they sound like all the rest let's try sorry if i sound over critical they're all just kind of starting to sound the same to me really i'm just shopping at on price at this point so let's go create audio use ultra realistic voices and i don't even get to test the ultra realistic voices or do i let's try paste larry let's do the popular ones let's try arthur since he's popular our attention has never been as overwhelmed or in demand as it is today we that's actually pretty dang good honestly i like that voice a lot that's uh, that came out great let's try brett merging neuroscience psychology and mind okay that one's not great let's try evelyn welcome to this tutorial nope merging neuroscience this book reveals where we can and cannot trust our intuition jordan's not bad arthur's the best so far extreme success by definition lies beyond the realm of normal action a remarkable man in possession of limitless curiosity so some of these voices are not bad. Let's let's listen to Ariana. Extreme success by definition. No. Welcome to this tutorial. This guide will take Not too bad. I'm just not a big fan of their pricing. They're kind of on the higher end of the pricing to be able to do anything meaningful with it. All right, let's move on. We've got Uber Duck here. They say they're the open source of voice AI community. And then for pricing, they've got E forever, five saved audio clips. And then for 10 bucks a month, you can have unlimited saved audio clips and Uber Duck Studio commercial use voices, AI generated raps, API access. For 50 bucks a month, you can clone your own voice. All right, let's do text to speech. Let's enter our text here. And there's a whole bunch of voices. Wait, I saw one that said Richard Hammond. Top Gear, really? Let's see what that sounds like. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency. I mean, it's not great, but not horrible either. Uh, let's try Tony Hawk. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for... It definitely sounds like Tony Hawk if Tony Hawk was a robot. <laughs> You could tell that it was actually sampled off Tony Hawk's voice, though. It's fairly impressive how well you could tell that it's supposed to be Tony Hawk. Ways to improve efficiency, save time and money, and increase the... It just kind of sounds like a horrible robotic voice of Tony Hawk. Interesting. What we got under here? There's a bunch of voices to try in this one. This one you can actually use for free. It's open source. Can't do the raps, unfortunately. Let's try the Animaniacs voice. Because fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency. I mean, it sounds pretty good. It's just very, very robotic sounding. I can't see any of these voices actually fooling anybody, but it's, it's surprising how close it actually sounds to the real voice without sounding real. So this one's Uber Duck. All right, we got resemble.ai. This one's got some interesting pricing. 0 0.006 cents per second. Let's go ahead and try this one out. I don't really like their pricing model because I don't really know how many seconds my thing is going to take up. So it just makes it sort of hard to predict. But let's test it out. And what do we got? We got Meditative Justin. Let's listen to Meditative Justin. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for... I'd rebrand that as Creepy Justin, honestly. Let's try Samantha. In today's fast-paced business environment, entrepreneurs are constantly looking for ways to improve efficiency. 
not too bad, but it's definitely a little robotic. It says, I've got voices waiting to be cloned. Let's go ahead and complete voice cloning. Matt's AI voice. Let's go ahead and record. All right, so I finished the voice training, but it says it's going to take a bit and they're going to email me when the voice is ready. So I'll probably make a future video of how the voice cloning works with resemble.ai and we'll circle back around to this one in a future video. So I'm going to close this one down. All right, so to kind of wrap this all up here, the ones that I found to be the best where I really like listener because you can put a hundred words in here and download it and sample it. And it seems like there's no limit to how much you can use their free samples here. And then their pricing isn't too bad at all at nine bucks a month for 10,000 words a month, which seems pretty generous. Listener gets one of my top picks. 11 Labs, I think, had the most realistic sounding voices of them all. So 11 Labs was really, really great as well. Now their pricing is 22 bucks a month. If you actually want to do anything meaningful with it to get the commercial license, license and actually be able to, you know, make money with the audio that you create. Great sounding audio, but 22 bucks a month to actually be able to use it in any meaningful way. Murph was also pretty good in order to be able to download them. You're going to need to pay about 29 bucks a month. And then Lovo seemed pretty good as well, but their lowest plan is at about 30 bucks a month to be able to do anything. So you're looking for the higher quality voice tools. You're looking at anywhere from 22 to 30 bucks a month to actually be able to generate anything that you can use commercially there's some great options out there so among the ones that i've experimented with today play around with them i'm going to make a future video about resemble.ai and some of these voice cloning tools that's a whole nother category on its own it's still text to speech but it's also trying to clone a voice so we'll come back around to that one later and uh, see how those tools compare but that's all i got for you in this video if you like these tools and you like what i'm talking about head over to futuretools.io this is where i aggregate and curate all the cool tools that I come across. I made them easy to sort, easy to search, and I even narrowed it down to my picks among the tools that I've played with. I've got a weekly newsletter that narrows it down to just the five favorite tools each week, plus three interesting news articles, three cool YouTube videos, and one new way to make money with AI every single week. I send those out on Friday. Just click join the free newsletter to sign up for that. And thanks so much for tuning in. I really appreciate you. And if you like this video, click the like button to make sure you see more of them and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I really appreciate you. Thanks for hanging out and nerding out with me and listening to some nice and also some very weird voices. See you later. Bye.